Hey there, this is Chad from Zombified Shark, and this is a quick tip on using key switches. Uh, so if you don't know how key switches work, uh, this will explain it. Um, so here I have two examples opened, uh, where I have a VSCO and um, the violin, and then I have contact instrument, the brass ensemble. So if uh, they, and, and you can see when they, this is kind of a standardized format. Um, contact is, is pretty much standardized this. So everybody kind of follows this. So if you open an instrument and you see this at the end of the keyboard or sometimes it's at the uh, top of the keyboard um, then that usually means there are key switches for this instrument um, and so what if you don't know what key switches are it's the uh, being able to switch between your different articulations of an instrument uh, and sometimes they do other things as well um, but for the for this demonstration it's going to be switching between articulations so um, here I have a short example uh, so first you can watch or listen to the violin pizzicato and now the horn All right, so how did uh, how did it do that? Um, so it's not not complicated at all. But if no one's ever shown you, then it you don't know how. So here is here's my piano roll for the notes on the uh, violin there, and here's the actual notes themselves. And then this is the key switch. So and you can see it corresponds to this part of the keyboard. So um, just for example, you can we'll change it right now. So um, now it's Arco. Now it's pizzicato. Now it's tremolo. And so whenever you're, you know, whatever you've written, you know, if you're changing between articulations in your piece, um, then this is, this is how easy it is. A uh, little bit extra work. So when you put in the work, then that's what makes your piece great. And this is part of that little bit of work you got to do. So there you go, and you can switch between them as fast as you can switch, uh, you know, as fast as the notes will go. One thing I have noticed that's worth mentioning, sometimes if your note starts at the exact same place that the key switch is, um, depending on the program you're using or depending on the, um, the instrument itself, um, it won't pick up the articulation on the first note. So frequently I will just move that note back just a few ticks uh, so that the articulation itself is the very first thing that comes in line. So I hope that that makes sense. If uh, it doesn't, please leave me a comment and I will try to explain it further. Thanks for watching. Uh, have a great day. Cheers.